It's me, Mario! Hmm. Ah! Oh. Guys, Luigi Man's 22 here. Welcome back to another episode. Let's play Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. On the last episode, I jump off the bridge. That's what we did on the last episode. No, and somehow I respawned back here. Makes sense. Um, what am I trying to say? On the last episode, I liquid Luigi my way through back through Ordon Village after finding out that you know Hyrule Castle is covered in twilight and. Now, now I just attack a bridge. Now in this episode, we're gonna head back inside to the light, twilight, power to twilight, do something, I don't know. As I stiff my way. Hey, look, the Pharaoh Woods that you know so well, they're now covered in twilight. You might not be able to come back here, but... You still want to go through? Of course! I have no other choice, do I? Because... <laughs> they always give you the option to say no, but hey... Guess what? Not everything is your way. Not everything is a, bur is a Burger King. God, now I suddenly want some Burger King. I haven't had Burger King in a while. Like, seriously. And there's only like one Burger King place in my area. And it's like, what, a couple miles away. Hmm, so these are the weapons you, you you use in your world. Yes, but that is not a mask. You're you're holding it wrong. Ah, don't swing that sword you were trying to do. Cut my head off? You really sing to stink and slay the creatures of Twilight? Well, I won't use these, but I'll hang on to them for you. Oh, and like that, they just disappear. Okay. Alright, a promise is a promise. I trust you enough to help. In exchange for my help, though, I'll need you to gather some things for me. Look, I can't tell you all the details now, but it'll be easy. Trust me. But enough about that. Do you hear that noise? It's the lamination of the spirit that had his light stolen. Where in the world could it be? <laughs> Better get going, don't you think? Don't blame me for your world's fate if you don't hurry up and find that light. Come on, snap to it! Okay, but I'm just- this is so creepy. Hearing a spirit wail like that. And now somehow we're teleported back to there. Before we were here, and then we suddenly ended up over there. I don't understand. I don't understand what's going on. Just like life. Oh, great, more of this. This should be easy, right? This is gonna be one of them trying to hurt my face. No? Oh, oh, oh no. It's more than one. Nah, it's still not gonna be a problem. I can eat, just eat their face off. Aw, we're penned again. <laughs> Who do you think they're dealing with? No need to take these little pests on one at a time. You can take them all at once. So, you can handle this by yourself, can't you? Good luck! Bye! Wow, way to leave me behind. Well, I guess just a symbol, uh, tail spin attack. Oh, no, one dodge. Okay, oh, oh. That's just great. So what do I do now? Every time I leave one alive, they're gonna attack me. Stop that! I'm about to die! What the hell? I just noticed! I'm about to die! What's the hold up? If you leave the last one alive, it's just gonna use that shriek to bring the others back. Listen, let me help you out of here. Just move like I tell you. Just You just hold down that and I'll expand the energy field. Enclose all your enemies within it and release the button. Okay, but I'm about to die, so I'm afraid. Just like that. That, that I didn't even do it right. This is how you're supposed to do it. Come on, come on, get the last. Wow! 
Yahoo! That's how you do it! That is how you freaking do it! I can't believe my first game over in this game has to be the, the simplest enemy ever! What the hell? I feel bad. I, I feel I I should hate myself for this. What the f Yahoo! I hate myself for this now. This is so dumb! This is terrible! And what's worse, I'm uploading this! That's what's worse! Please be careful. These woods have changed. The dark clouds of dust cover this land. This drape of a shat drape of shadows is called twilight. In this twilight, those who live in the light become as mere spirits. It is a place where the dark ones and evil creatures dwell. I am a spirit of light. Blue-eyed beast. Look for my light. Retrieve the light stolen by the dark beast and keep it in this vessel. And so we got the vessel of light. Get used to seeing this for a while. When the vessel is full of tears, you can dispel the twilight and return the land to its light-filled state. To see the evils that consume the tears, press that to use your senses. Ooh. In the shadows of twilight, the dark insects are as invisible as normal beings here. Let me use the last of my power to reveal the locations of the dark insects that consume the light. So, we got a bit to do. <laughs> Find the insects of darkness. The dark insects, they are the form taken by evil. Once it has latched onto our scattered light. Okay, great. And now as you can see, it, uh, the vessel of light thing has now appeared on the left side on screen. So that way you guys, you, can, you guys know, that way you can keep track of your progress. And there they are right now. I'm ignoring you because ah, I just got hit. Die. No, not you. You. Die. Die. There we go. Okay, now let, let me absorb the lights into my body. Come, come over here. Where, where's the other one? There it is. There we go. Two down. I think eight more to go. No, not even eight. Oh, there's one right there. No. Ah, oh, it's hidden itself over there, but we're gonna take a slight detour because we're gonna need a thing. That, and I think there's some insects here that I'm, some may miss. I think one over here? I'm trying to look at my map. No, oh, no, wait. I see an opening. Yeah, I know we can get in there. That's why I called you, didn't Isn't that why? I still can't believe I got that game over. What the hell is wrong with me? What's with these bugs? Those things aren't normal, man! They're so big! So weird! So creepy! Come on, get away, bugs! Shoo! Get, get out of here! Oh, hey, well, you know, there's two of them! Uh, dead! What? They just died? Oh, boy. I have no idea what's going on around here. Good. It's better that you don't. Now give me those things! And I need to get out of here. Just go back the way we came and that should do it! Alright, so there is one more here, I believe. One more of these, uh, bugs. If I could see target in the right place. See it? You see it right there? See it? Just tackle the wall and attack it! Attack it! Attack it! On. It's not that hard. Now come over here and get inside my body. Thank you for getting inside my body. Please come again. Alright, so we're done with this area for now. As you can see, there are no white dots on the map. But there's still the matter of this annoying little bugger. Annoying little bugger, which I will slap you in the face. Where are you? Oh, there are two of you. Oh, easy. Come on, get back inside my bod. Come on. There we go. Back inside my bod. We're almost done. I think we're halfway through. 
it's not that hard, but in later areas, yeah, you might as well get used to this, because later areas, it's gonna get tricky. Trust me, I, I know, because I think I missed one on my first playthrough here. Whatever. Just, I'm just ignoring all of the enemies. Screw them. I'm not getting another game over. It's still bugging me. It really is bugging me. Oh, hey, what happened here? There's now a fog. A deep purple mist fog thing. But ignore that, because we got two of these little invisible buggers, twilight bugs over here that are flying away from me. Please don't fly away from me. Because I'm about to eat your- Aw, oh, you jerk! Come on! No, Z target! There we go. Just get you in my body, and where's the other one? There it is. Come on, get inside! Okay, there we go. I think that's all from here. The rest is just above, just near that fog. But we need to find a way to get over there, which is here! Hey, think we can get across over here? I don't know, can we? Jump, jump, jump! And then jump! For my life! For my life! And then we gotta do it one again, and there are bugs here! There are three of them here, and... Why bother? I'm just gonna do this. This is my favorite move, by the way. But I never got to mention this, because I got, you know, KO'd, but yeah, this move. This move right here, this will be very useful to you. It's like a better spin attack, in my opinion. Alright, I think this is the way we gotta go. I, I lost track. Jump away! And then we gotta jump through here and avoid those Deku Bombas! Don't eat my face! Oh, come on, really? Really? Who put that there? Now we gotta avoid the keys. It's like an obstacle course here, man. Ah, uh, yes. We gotta dig these guys out. Come on, dig them out. Oh, I did not mean to attack them! Forgot the one thing to mention. You can't attack them while they're, you know, electrified. Because they hurt you. And get over here! Really? Get over here! Get inside me! Oh, uh, and of course you went back on the ground, you little jerk. Get back over here. I said get back over here. Come on, get! Why is it so hard? It's not that hard. Come on, get inside my body. There's like two more I gotta get. All right, and now we got more of this shadow beast, and there's three of them. So you know what that means. Come on, follow me. Follow me, guy. You know you want to follow me. You too. Come on. Get over here. Get over here. That way I can do this and eat your face off. Well, it's not. I'm not really eating their face off because I'm not attacking them head on. But hey, it's almost the same thing. This is sort of. Alrighty then. So last two should be at the end of this path here. Is there anyone here? No one is here. Just too bad because I would love to get some more free stuff. Alright, so, how you guys doing? Trying to make conversation, because I don't care. Oh, there's a spirit there. Let's just see what she, what, let's just see what this monkey has to say. Come on, let me, listen. He can't help! Really, that's it? Oh god, that one actually leaped in front of me! Leaped in my face! No, no, Z target this thing. Attack it. And then two are gonna magically go inside my body. Okay, just that one. Someone? Someone help me? Boy, lucky for me. Ever since the boss went funny in the head, there has been scary monsters everywhere. Those village kids got led through the woods for some reason. The whole forest is so weird now. What's happened? I don't know, but I got the feeling I'm about to find out after this cutscene! Don't you just love cutscenes? <laughs> the vessel of light is full of tears and light has returned to this area. Congratulations, you won. And everything is now colorful.
and not in Twilight. Aww, but it was so nice here in its Twilight. What's so great about a world of light anyway? See you later. Wait, you're just gonna disappear now? Disappear into the spring? Well, this spirit's gonna pop up out of nowhere! That is a thing. My name is Pharaon. I am one of the spirits of light who dwell in Hyrule. I use the life force of the gods to protect this force. Oh, brave youth. In the land covered in twilight where people roam as spirits, you were transformed into a blue-eyed beast. That was a sign. It was a sign that the powers of the Chosen One rest within you, and that they are awakening. Look at you! Look at your awakened form. What? Oh my God! I'm wearing green, which is neat. I'm also wearing gloves now. The green tunic that is your garb once belonged to the ancient hero chosen by the gods. His power is yours. He is, his is the true power that slept within you. Your name is Link. You are the hero chosen by the gods. Bam! Dramatic! Brave Link. A dark power rests in the temple deep within these woods. It is the forbidden power. Long, long ago, I and the other spirits of light locked it away. Because of its nature, it is a power that should be never touched by any who dwell in the light. But this world weeps beneath a mantle of shadows, and so there is no choice. You must match the power of the King of Shadows. If you would seek this forbidden power, then proceed to the temple in the forest depths. Okay, great. Just, just great. I'm just gonna stare at my hand. You know where the power of the Triforce is. You can't see it because I'm wearing gloves. Well, well. You're the chosen hero, and that all that, huh? So that's why you turn into that beast. What a shame. I mean, maybe you rather just wander as a spirit like the rest of them, totally unaware of what ha what was happening for all eternity, right? <laughs> so what do you want to do? Do you want to head to that temple? Well, isn't that convenient? I was about to head there myself. Hey, look, you want to help your friends, right? The way I see it, maybe they're in that temple, waiting for you to rescue them. Well, good luck, Mr. Important Hero. Uh, and now she's in my shadow forever. Uh, so I'm not looking forward to this temple. I re l let me just say this: this temple. I, I let me say just I, I'm not looking forward to this temple for various reasons. Those reasons I'll get to in a minute. But I would call this an episode, but I don't, because you know I want to continue on. Oh God, come on! Because, you know, we just turned into human, uh, son of a... Really? Just let me jump strike you! I love that pose, by the way! I love it! Oh, I just love that pose. You know, I'll... Just leave you alone. What's up, guy? Huh? So, it's the Ordonian! You seem familiar, but then your clothes seem kind of different, so I got thrown off by a sec for a sec. Listen, things have been a little rough around here lately, so you should watch your step, okay, guy? There are so many monsters now, I got kind of scared and closed off the path to the temple. But, you guy, you want to get back there, huh? You sure look geared up for it, so here you go. 
Give me that key, that's brilliant. Oh yeah, the woods on the other side of the cave are covered in really thick fog, so make sure your lantern is full. You're definitely gonna need it if you use your lantern a lot in there, so bring all the oil you can! And check this out, I have a special one-time offer of a bottle full of lantern oil for only a hundred rupees! I would get it, but I don't have enough. What? That's not right, guy! I gave you the lantern for free, man! I also sell oil on its own, so come back when you run out, guy! Well, my lantern's pretty much full, so I really don't care. Uh, what happens when you light these up? I never figured that out, and I've always ignored them. Nothing! They just do stuff! So! Yeah! You guys search for rupees if you want it. Uh, you don't have to get it now. I, I don't believe you don't have to get it now. I mean, it's convenient. It's another bottle, but eh. I don't see myself needing a second bottle at the moment. So, you can grind for rupees if you want. There are, like, tall grass that you can just cut away. And rupees will magically pop out. Like right here. So, like I said, you can if you want to. I'm not going to at the moment. Uh, we will come back through here, so don't worry if, you, if you're if you afraid you're going to miss it. I thought you died. I know I said I'm not going to get it, but I'm just like, just wildly swinging my sword. Let's just go, go on through here. Uh, more of this shenanigans. I'm ignoring everyone here. I have a sword now. I can actually hurt you. You can't you can't hurt me, but uh, I just don't feel like it. You know why? Cause I don't care. So I don't care. So I don't care. So just roll away. Just roll away. Just roll away down the cave. Cause that's the best and simple way you can do it. And somehow we're magically back over there, and I never understood that. Hey, my lantern! That dang monkey stole my lantern! I don't know how I feel about that. Hey, what's this monkey's problem? You idiot! While you were staring off into dreamland, your lantern got stolen! Hey, don't call me an idiot! I will stab you! Actually, you can't, because you actually need that monkey to lead you through the fog. Because you can't do anything without that your lantern or that monkey. And that monkey wants my help for some reason. I don't even know why I have my sword out. I'm coming! Yeah. This, this is going to be a thing for a while. I said I'm coming! I see you, treasure chest, but I can't get you. I don't think at the moment... Actually, no. No, I can't, because the fog is still over there. I believe... I, I'm, I'm not sure. I, I know it happened to me before, but if I, I believe if you, like, uh, step into the fog, you, like, instantly transport back to the beginning. Keys, get out of here! You get transported back to the beginning of the uh, area. If I remember correctly, which I never do, and I'm trying to play this from memory. Also, if you skipped out on that heart piece that I got in, like, the, what, the second episode or something? Where we had to go through the woods to rescue the kids? You can't right now. Can't do it right now because of A, the monkey has your lantern. And B, there's fog in this area and you need your lantern. You can always come back here, I believe, with your lantern. But right now it's impossible because the monkey is leading you away from that area. And I see a Deku Baba. Just, hey, you can see it through the fog. Look at it. It's like drooling. It's, it's, it's craving blood. No! That's not fair! Jump! Attack you in the face! I so love that. I'm gonna be doing that every time, by the way. If you don't like that, screw you. Where are you? I'm like going in the right direction. You're just not moving. I want those seeds. Give me those seeds! No! I want to have that one extra seed. And that's it! We did it! I don't know why that monkey's still doing what she's doing, but hey, whatever. Teach to your own. Uh, seriously, I have to come to you, but you're gonna move anyways? That's so dumb. Okay. But, my lantern. Can I pick it up, please? Can I pick up my lantern? Holy crap! 
Hello? Dang, game! You got the lantern bag, but it ran out of oil. So that's sort of... Uh, your fault? Give me that. I'm gonna put that back in my B-slot. I don't care if it's not needed. I don't. Oh, hey, look. Enemies. Hey, guys. How's it going, spin attack? Chop you in the face! Chop you in the face! Chop you in the face like your friend there! And more rupees. Wow, I'm gonna reach 100 rupees, aren't I? I mean, get that rupee! Fine. No, don't disappear on me. Don't disappear on me. But we're gonna call this an episode, because I decided it's fine. Yeah, yeah, you can peck me all you want. I'm gonna get a game over, aren't I? Get away from me! So, on the next... Get, get away. On the next episode of Let's Play Legend of Zelda's Mother Princess! Oh, we're gonna go through the Forest Temple, and you guys are gonna enjoy my fear of a specific enemy that is there. So, if you like this video, hit like, subscribe, and favorite, do whatever! I faced the wrong way, and now I don't care, now I'm looking that way. And I'll see you guys next time on the exciting adventure that we're about to go through. <laughs> oh, I'm not happy. Hey there, guys. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Click the stuff you see on screen right now to open something in a new window or tab. Got tips, tricks, or something you want to tell me? Leave a comment below. I'll answer them. I also have a Facebook and Twitter, so you can face tweet me there. In the description below. But no one checks those anymore. And it's sad.